guys hello there so today's prompt is uh for november is uh, uh, it's it's the day 5 and the prompt was very simple it was class and just for information i am sketching i really wanted to uh, uh show you guys my whole process of how i sketch and how i go about my drawings initially i was uh I had done the hair, uh, but then I went in and uh, placed my camera uh, for recording my whole process of how I do that. This uh, like uh, a girl prompt for Kofember, and if you guys don't know what Kofember is, it's a thirty day month uh, uh, challenge, and the media which you have to use for art is coffee. So. Uh, for that i'm sketching out uh, uh, a girl who's wearing this nice jacket i think this uh, piece has turned out nicely with the pencil and i'll show you how i go in with the coffee and with the coffee which i'll be using is uh, this nescafe classic instant coffee it's available for like very uh, like cheap and uh, i've taken some of the coffee and added some water to it and i'll be taking just a light wash of color of other skin and i felt like it was too dark so i went in and diluted the color and then went in for the skin of the girl initially i was planning on doing uh, her hair tied up but uh, then i changed my mind and i just wanted to give her look uh, a nice a nice opened up hair because uh, i wear glasses and I know glasses look better on open hair rather than tied up hair uh that's how I personally feel and uh I just wanted to draw her hair and uh, another thing is that I wanted to practice hair because um the strands of the hair are uh, is the one thing that I am not good at drawing and uh, especially when it comes to lining my artwork just with a a black pen or any kind of pen i tend to mess up the hair strands and it doesn't go off in uh, nicely and smoothly so i went in um uh, with the open hair and not the not the bun or a tied up hair and i just wanted to make this girl a uh, look fabulous um you can see that uh, there are some areas where you can see the patches kind of thing um, that is due to the paper because i've added too much water but uh uh that won't bother after it dries up uh, the paper will uh, come back to its normal uh, state and uh, this happens with this paper i don't know why uh, this is actually an a4 size paper of 100 gsm uh, i bought uh, it in bulk of 500 sheets so uh, this uh, sketchbook is actually a spiral bound sketchbook uh, which i've made out of uh, A4 size paper folded into half, and I got it spiral binded uh, because I felt like um, uh, taking a paper of your choice is much easier rather than um, uh, buying a whole bunch of sketchbooks. I don't know why, but I I prefer buying sketchbooks. But sometimes I go for uh, customizing my sketchbooks uh, the way I want to, and. And that's just my personal preference. Uh, and uh, when you have five hundred loose sheets, you can uh, definitely uh use some pages for sketching and some pages for uh just individual drawings on a sheet of paper. So maybe that's the reason why I thought of uh, making these custom sketchbooks for myself. And moving on with the sketches here, I went in for a darker wash of color. color of coffee because i wanted to make her denim jacket uh, look a bit darker and um i didn't want to i actually wanted to layer this coffee for the jacket but then i thought uh, why not uh, just try out uh, the darker shade and uh, there you can see the shade uh, was quite dark while i was applying so i had to spread it out evenly to uh, give it a smooth finish and and i really enjoyed the whole process of making this curl because uh she looked really nice and i wanted to make her look pretty so yeah i'll just put a uh, music in the background and i'll meet you guys in the end till then bye bye 
Alonso.
piece i'm really happy with the whole piece and yeah do follow me on instagram and do comment down below if you guys like this challenge and if you want to follow you can follow me uh by just adding a ha hashtag of coffember and yeah i hope you guys like this uh sketch of mine and thanks for watching and thanks for supporting me and thank you for subscribing and yeah uh i'm really thankful for all of you guys so yeah bye bye